going on? It's off here, and today I'm bringing you a video that maybe you guys, maybe some of you guys have seen, maybe some of you guys haven't. But this is the biggest um, VAC band account, and if you don't know what a VAC band is, um, it's a cheating account, basically using cheats or hacks um, on a secured server, and he got, I guess, um, uh, caught. So basically, this is a uh, account called Hehe. Um, he's obviously a cheater, as you know, as you can tell. He got back in eight days ago. Um, this video was on Mick Skillet's um, channel. I will link his channel in the description because that's where I got the video idea from. But yeah, so he has I think a twenty-five thousand dollar account, which is insane. So let's get right into this. So. First of all, you could see a Stat Trek R8 Revolver Fade um, Factory New. Um, so next we have a Stat Trek M4A4 How with four t or no three Titan Hollows and it's Factory New. Five thousand dollars maybe. Just prediction. Next he has a. This is like a terrible gun. I don't know. I don't, I don't think this is rare or anything. I think he has the most expensive Mac 10 skin, which is the Stat Trek Mac 10 Graven Factory New. Not sure how much this goes for, but it's a pretty expensive gun. I'll inspect it. No, I won't. Never mind. Next, he has a um, an almost full blue 57 case hard in factory new, a uh, blue gem one. He has the newer threat uh, pair, I guess. He has the Tech Nine and the P250, both factory new, both with the same stickers, all hollows, which is just usual. The most expensive Stat Trek CZ75, which is the Victoria factory new and Stat Trek. Next, he has a USPS kill confirmed. Um, not really an expensive. I mean, it is an expensive kit. Okay, like I can't say anything. It's an expensive kit. Okay, next, he has two I buy power hollows, which are just like the most expensive sticker in the entire game. They go for like maybe a thousand, maybe two thousand dollars a piece, something like that. Um, the Tech Nine Eagle Threat again. This I don't think it goes. He had the these stickers by himself. I think all together, some of these can sell for like five hundred dollars a piece, which is you know, just the usual. Next, he has a Stat Trek M4A1S with four Titan Hollows. Four Titan Hollows. That's insane. This gun is worth so much money by itself. Um, next, he has a Fuel Rod Stat Trek B Bison. I don't think this says goes for a whole lot. Next, he has a Souvenir Galil AR Cerberus with three. Um, gold stickers on it because it's souvenir for us. Uh, next, he has a Stat Track Factory New Blood and Water, which is like $200, I think, maybe $400, something like that. Next, he has a Stat Track Nova Bloomstick, which is a pretty nice looking gun. Um, yeah, oh yeah, I forgot to mention the four I by Powers right here. Just, you know, just chilling here. And next, and he has another one right here. Then now he has a P2000 Ocean Foam Factory New. I don't know how much this skin goes for. I may put down, I may put all of the prices in the description, so make sure to check down there. Next, he has a MP7 Ocean Foam, so he has the Ocean Foam pairing. Um, he has a uh, M9 Bayonet Crimson Web Factory New. Um, I think these are really insanely rare to get Factory New. So that's just the usual. I don't think this goes for a whole lot. Uh, oh, this thing. Stat Track Deagle Crimson Web Factory New is like, maybe $500, I think. Um, Death by Kitty, I think that's the most expensive P90 skin. Um, he has a Glock 18 Fade, which is like $100 to $200 by itself. He has a Famos Stick Souvenir Factory New with four gold stickers on it, of course. Next, he has a full, uh, blue Karambit Staff... No, 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 okay, English. He has a Stat Track Karambit Doppler. Blue gem. Huh. As I meant to say. Next, uh, the last page of his skins. He has the, uh, by the way, he has a sapphire pairing and the Krambit and the M9 bayonet. Um, he has a Stat Track Minimal Wear AK Redline because just the usual, right? Next, he has a uh, Souvenir XM uh, Bone Machine with all of the stickers on it. Um, he has an, a Souvenir MP9 Hot Rod with, of course, all the stickers on it and Factory New. Um, he has the Stat Track M9 bayonet. Uh, Factory new Doppler, of course. Um, he has the Souvenir Aug uh, Radiation Hazard Factory new with all the stickers on it. And we're coming up to the last uh, like skins that are actually amazing. This is I don't think this goes for a lot. Actually, it might because it's Souvenir and Factory new. 
So, dual Beretta's Briar. He has a Souvenir Ump Blaze. Um, I think this is a pretty expensive skin. And then next, he has a Stat Track Scar 20 Cyrex Factory New. I'm not sure what this will go for. And then all of these badges, all these coins and stickers, they're probably... They could probably sell for about 100 a piece, and there's like 10 of them. So... Yeah, this this inventory worth is a this inventory is about worth twenty five thousand dollars as I said before, but yeah, and it got back banned, so now he can't sell or trade this inventory or anything, and he can't play the game anymore. So basically, he has all of this money just sitting in his account that he can't use anymore because it's all just there now because he can't give it to friends. It's just there. Which really does suck, that's why you guys don't cheat, you guys don't ever cheat in games. Please don't cheat, don't, don't more cheat. But yeah, so, this kid's, I guess he's out of luck, really. I mean, he just lost $25,000 worth of items. Now, I don't know if he, um, I don't know if he, like, traded for these, or he actually, like, unboxed this kind of stuff. But you never know. So yeah, this kid lost $25,000 because he was cheating. So remember guys, don't cheat in games unless you want to lose like really expensive stuff like this kid did. But yeah, make sure you guys do leave a like down below on this video. Make sure you guys check out the description for a mixed skills video link because he probably explained it a bit better than I can. And I'll have all the prices in the description for almost all of this stuff. He has like a lot of items. So I'll find a way to um, uh, find the prices. Yeah. Okay, see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.